everybody this is our first experimental video clouds using credit cards the picture you see in front of you is what I'm going to try and emulate good luck to that I have my tools in front of me a couple of credit cards that have been cut up into a variety of shapes and sizes and my acrylic paper which I just sewed black because I feel that is the appropriate colour to have as a background colour to begin with and all the paints I'm going to be using because obviously I'm going to use a little bit of artistic license as well. Now if you look at the picture the thing that is furthest away from me that is behind the clouds is this area here so I'm going to try and work on that using the scrape on and scrape off technique which is I have drawn out uh, very roughly in pencil on the black so it is a question of scrape on and then literally scrape off so that some of the black underneath is showing a bit of black and Prussian blue I'm literally scraping it off again and scraping it on. Right, I'm working from the back forward so the last bit I shall paint will be this area of cloud which to me looks as if it is furthest to the front. So I'm starting from this grey green area at the back now and I'm putting it on in little marks more white so I'm, not, I'm sort of moving the, the credit card around in different directions We're allowing a little bit of the black from underneath showing through Blending it in at the edges by lightly touching it. And I will continue this area and going into a bit of an orangey colour over here. And it's moving the credit card around so that your marks are not stilted and all in the one direction. You can turn the credit card on its edge as well. As I'm coming further forward, I'm laying on the paint just a little bit thicker. Allowing it just to mix a little bit on the paper.
showing less of the black. Again, at turning the credit card in slightly different directions so you don't get a uniformity of line and texture. I don't want quite so much of the dark showing up here. I'm going to start in, start in the bottom right hand corner again, again alternating the marks that you make and mixing Prussian blue with a little bit of black and tiny dots of magenta, bringing it towards the other clouds. gradually introduce a little bit of the yellow ochre for this area here and that area there. Just tiny marks so they're quite subtle. Do not keep your marks in the same direction, keep moving them around. Oops, a little bit too much blue because it's gone greeny, so I will just put a little bit more black on the top of that. And if I don't like it, I can actually even scrape it away. And then over it. I have used a little bit of artistic license and made the colours perhaps a little bit stronger than they actually are on the picture but we are interpreting rather than copying. Right, we'll come back to this when I've finished it. Now I'm taking uh, a credit card which I've cut into a point to sort of bring out the edges a little bit more. I'm just squiggling with it to some extent. 
just on the edges. The small marks. Give a cloud in some areas a little bit of definition. Scratch a little bit through. For a loose interpretation. And there you have clouds using credit card. Good luck. <laughs>